Good morning, y'all. Bon dia a todos. Today we're going to change the pressure temperature sensor. Hoje vamos mudar a, a chama de pressure temperature sensor. Então, uh, part number 289-7334. O número da parte é 289-7334. And this sensor is located on the right side of the Commons ISF 15. You guys want to look for this tube, you guys, vocês querem olhar para este tube, ele fica no lado direito do motor Commons ESC15. Ok, you want to look over here on the top, the engine, it's going to be over here, on this line, so it's going to be, this is the sensor, ok? Isto é o sensor. Okay, so for that sensor, the plug is broke. So I guess the guy, the guy who was running this truck, he broke that. And but he's plugged it anyway. So it's tap partido aqui, o plug tap partido. So but but mas está está bom anyway. The plug, it's like this one. I changed this sensor recently. You guys can check my video. That plug over here, this plug is como este, igualzinho. You have to press this all the way. And this part is going to pop up. I'm going to do it just for you guys to see. See? You have to do it exactly the same over there, and then click it. Okay? But I don't want to take it out. I want to keep it like this. So. Vocês têm, suposto ter um botãozinho aqui, descarregam para lá e depois aqui para baixo. É, mas é como eu disse, está partido. A gente só faz assim, tira o sensor. Ok. Vamos take the harness like this. For that, you guys need a hand socket with a 10mm socket. Vocês precisam desta ferramenta. Um socket de 10 mm, ok? So, see that screw over there? That's the screw you guys want to take out. So, you can see, it's gentle. Okay. Was a bit. You guys don't need to take the, the screw out. I'm going to show you guys why, because o parafuso não precisa de sair, só vocês só precisam fazer assim, como vocês estão a ver, just loosen the screw and push these parts all the way over there, all the way, so it's good now. You guys want to make sure this is clean, ok, to take that sensor out, para tirar este sensor out, Vocês têm que tomar muito cuidado, you have to be very, very careful, because this is all plastic, ok? So, I want to show you guys the parts, actually. This is plastic, this is a sensor plastic, it's all plastic, so I think you have to be very careful. Ok, so... That's the sensor. Okay. Okay. All plastic. This is the sensor. It is all plastic. You have to remove. Or to remove the sensor, so you can see that there is space here. To put one hand here and the other here, I can put the two fingers like this and just shake it like that slowly. See, look. Slowly and going up, left and right, left and right, left and right, left and right, and up at the same time. So the sensor did come out. I did clean this sensor before. That's why it does not look so bad. But uh, yeah, I, I did clean this sensor before, but yeah needs to be changed it was really really bad 
and uh, for the price this sensor the Olympus sensor e o, ele estava muito mal mas eu agora tenho que mudá-lo so that's the, the new one let me see if I can because the zoom is too much zoom ok ok we're gonna put the piece together over there see the wall over there we're gonna put the piece over there nice and tight push it up. wait a second guys tem uma borracha ali, aquela borracha e há uma rubber, não sei, that green rubber over there that, that green rubber that gonna be a pain in ass to put it in it's really hard to put it in I'm gonna do it like the same way One second, guys. Okay, uh, that, yeah, it was really hard to put it back. So you guys maybe want to use like this, just to give a bit pressure over here, not like crazy. It was seem difficult to pour, because it's new, and the glass is hot. It was hot, so if you want to do it with force with this lock, it's a little bit, not a lot of force, not like crazy, okay? So now, now, I want to put this part back over here. See? Vocês querem pôr a parte outra vez aqui. E com a ferramenta, o hand socket, with the hand socket, you want it. One second, guys. Sorry, I'm doing this, everything with two hands. One, one hand only, doing the job. So, vocês querem apertar e uma tight Ops. Ok. Tight. Ok, once you see it's not going anymore, just see it's not going anymore, it's like it's tight. But you want to do just like this, give some more pressure and that's it, don't do too much because you can break it. Quando vocês veem que ele está, estão a apertar e depois não vai mais, vocês só agarram um bocadinho e dão um bocadinho de pressão para ele, para ele ir, ok? Mas, mas não muito. So, como vocês podem ver, como eu disse, o plug aqui está partido. It's broken the plug over here. The, the, the guy has this truck before, maybe try to take it or something. Uh, so normally you have the thing to push there and put it in. In this and then in this case I was have to press over here down just to lock it. So right now I'm gonna put it, the, the plug over here. I believe it's not gonna nowhere. It's connected. Connected is good. And this one, I have to find a way to have this sensor. Okay, guys, okay, meus amigos, isto é como se muda o óleo, a pressão do óleo, o sensor da pressão do óleo. Pronto, the pressure sensor uh, on the Commons ISX15. Don't forget it is on the right side of the engine, as you guys can see. That's the driver's side, that's the right side of the engine, it's on this side, okay? Thank you, and please don't forget to share, subscribe, 
and comment on my channel, okay? Peace.